real, really fought your way around today. Yeah, it was um, pretty tough conditions. It was a tricky wind, and I didn't get off for the best start. A um, couple over through 10, but um, fought pretty hard. Made a couple of putts there on the back nine, and to shoot under par, I was really happy with that. Uh, would have been pretty easy to to shoot, you know, one or two over and be out of the tournament. But uh, I feel like I'm still in it. What's it going to take tomorrow, Mark? Like you, a lot of guys have been going up and down in the one spot today. Like, but you're still within striking distance, you feel? Yeah, definitely. Um, I think the course is getting firmer and, and tougher, um, especially if the wind stays like this. It's, it's really hard to pick. You know, you're hitting good shots and airmailing greens and leaving them short. I think it's the same for everyone. But um, yeah, it, it's it's tough. I'll, I mean, I'll need to play really well, um, but you know, I feel like I've, my game's there. It's ready, ready to do that. It's just a matter of making the putts. So um, hopefully, I can get the speed of the greens, make some putts, and put some pressure on them at least. Yeah, golf's always a sport where players have prided themselves on honour and honesty and everything. Did you see Patrick Reed? Um, what happened overnight? Have you got any thoughts on that? Um, yeah, I did see it, and it looked pretty ordinary, to be honest. So. Um, that's probably all I can say about that. Yeah, didn't look, didn't look too good for him. Do you expect banter. you'll get a roasting from the crowds when he gets here? Yes. <laughs> there's a bit of banter, Mark, there's a bit of banter on Twitter and stuff like that with kids digging sand out of holes and stuff like that. We'd like to see fans turn up with shovels and that to sort of stir him up a bit. President's Cup. There's opportunities there, put it that way. <laughs> um, maybe not shovels, but yeah, I think um, he's definitely opened the door there. That he's bought on himself. Would you encourage fans to bring out the passion in this regard? Oh, as long as it's not disrespectful, I think. Yeah. Um, you, know, you, ne you never want to cross the line, but um, I think there's some pretty good ammo there in there. Would you like to play? I don't really care who I play, to be honest. Yeah, I'm, whoever Ernie puts me up against, I'm, I'm happy to play. Um, yeah, yeah, you're good for Tiger, no, aren't you? No, no, I'm not really. Uh, <laughs> I don't want to give anyone any any ammunition to uh, to want to beat us any more than what they already do. So um, I'll just hopefully play good golf, be who I'm playing, and um, hopefully we'll have a successful week. Mate, just back to the task at hand tomorrow. How far back do you hope is the minimum at the end of the oh, play today? I think I'll from within five or six. Um, you know, obviously I'd like to be closer than that, but I think six is gettable with the way, you know, the, I think the course will firm up a lot tomorrow. Um, <coughs> and the, you've got, you've the got form in that hard. regard too, haven't Yeah, you? I've, I've come from a long way back before. Um, it's just, you know, whoever wins is going to have to play well. It doesn't matter if you're four in front or four behind. Um, you know, you're not going to win a tournament of this calibre and against a field like this without playing really good golf. So I've played decently so far, just probably left a few shots out there on the greens, just not getting them to the hole. But um, yeah, I'm hoping for a big day tomorrow, get off to a fast start and put some pressure on the leaders. Still in it? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Thank you, thank you gentlemen, thank you. Thank you.